would do like a vlog come spend the day with me type things because I'm going to be out in DC um and it should be like a cute little touristy day so thought I would do something with you guys bring you along um but before make sure you like this video um and you subscribe to my channel i want to do more like vlogs because i do well, i'm always out and about in the series so if you want to see that make sure you like and comment that you like this and uh, subscribe to my channel too and we can do more of it um but my mother wants to take my sister to the portrait gallery um well she wants to take her to the museum with photography um, so we're leaning either to the natural art museum or the um, portrait gallery. So I'm not sure which one yet we're going to do. I think we're going to do the portrait gallery. I really do want to do that because I'm going to see the Michelle and Obama. I have not seen it. I think it's honestly like if you're born and raised here, it takes you some time to actually like do the touristy thing because you like don't really care for the tourist people <laughs> like or the crowds and stuff like that it's just like you don't kind of do it and then when you get older you're like oh well you know i kind of want to expose myself culturally um and especially like your kids and stuff too so uh that's what so yeah like i'm very much into it. it's like howard homecoming like i've never been to howard homecoming um, and that's because I'm here and it's just like, it's never been a, like, it's never been a want for me to really go. Like, honestly, I think cause I'm just here and everyone talks about it. And I'm also like that person that doesn't like to do what everybody else does. Um, I'm very like, I'm trying to do this. I don't want to ball headed, but yeah, so we're going to downtown um i kind of i'm not gonna do a lot of makeup i'm just literally putting on foundation and that's it so because my skin has kind of been like breaking out a little bit and that's because i just didn't know like shit so i have no one to blame on myself um so yeah i'm like trying to start the eating right shit so getting myself together like how it was last year um, so I'm just doing my foundation right now. I'll show you what I'm wearing after I finish. And yeah, I'm like, I'm super excited to see Barack and Michelle like, portraits. Like, I have yet to see them. And I kind of wanted it to die down a little bit when it first came out. Oh, I did like a concealer underneath my foundation because I kind of... I'm not because I'm not gonna put on concealer and I want it to at least brighten it up a little bit but still like not look crazy um so I did it under my foundation to do kind of like a natural brightening and you know make sure it's all blended out um, with my foundation so it looks like I don't maybe have on concealer but I do um so yeah, I really want to see Barack and Michelle. I don't know what is going on in my nose. It's like, I gotta get a tissue. Nose is running. Um, I'm really excited to see Barack and Michelle. Um, if you like follow me on Instagram, you know I'm like big on museums. I love going to museums. Um, the portrait gallery is like one that I haven't been to. I think the next one I really want to go to is the Holocaust Museum. Um, really into that stuff um or going to museums and just looking at different art and pieces and cultures and very very much into it um if i travel more i would go to more but i live in dc so i'm like why not take opportunity of it um mix in we just went to the air and space museum last month loved it um so i kind of want to take him back to the natural history museum because he loved that too I'm not even doing i'm not doing anything i'm literally just putting foundation on not 
doing a daggone thing to my face. Um, my skin is like so radiant because of the serum I use. If you would like to know what I use, comment below. Um, I'll do a post on that. I literally just blew out my hair um, just because I didn't know what to do with it. So like when I just don't want to put too much heat on it, I'll just blow out my hair and then put it in a bun. So and then I just did my little baby hair and stuff, let it sit for a second. And yeah. She's from every day. And I actually like doing a bun when it, when my hair is blown out because my bun is like way fuller. I suggest you do that. Like if you want to do a blowout, you don't even have to flat iron your hair. Just blow it out. Slick it down with some gel do your baby hairs and then do it in a bun. And I swear to you, your bun will be like way fuller. It's like a, a cheat code. Um, which I like. And then I can like work out with it. I don't gotta worry about, you know, like sweating my hair out because it's just blown out. It's no like heat to it. What the hell? Oh my eyes. Oh, what's up today? My favorite Gucci bloom. It's the red one. So it's just the regular. I think the first one, the Gucci bloom, which is my favorite. So I'm just gonna spit this down. on shoes and then i'm gonna come back hope i'm not being like super dry but um yeah let me decide on shoes and then oh, let me get out of my light let me decide on shoes and then i will come back and let you know exactly what i'm wearing all right y'all this is the outfit i have on this calls uniqlo t-shirt actually my first time wearing it because i have well i purchased like a couple of them um and I think I've only worn maybe once. So this is the first time I'm wearing this. This is in an extra small. Um, and then I have on these oversized sweatpants, gray from, where did I get these from? Um, pretty little thing, I think. And they're like very oversized. Make me look big, but I kind of like that fit on me. And have on my Nike Air Force Ones in this camel color which was a fucking sale i got these on sale these were the last pair left um super lucky in getting these i think these are my first time like actually wearing these out somewhere um and it was between these and the um retros but i actually like the way this pops with it and i like the high top excuse my son he's like nixon nixon you're really loud so this is what I'm wearing. Um, I'm gonna have my Supreme crossbody. And then I'm probably going to, hmm, I haven't been outside yet. So I'm gonna figure out what coat I'm gonna wear cause I don't wanna be like too hot or hot while walking through the museum. But I also want to be comfortable and not freezing cold. But yeah, this is my outfit. Super mommy, um, the bracelet, David Yerman. And then this is like my high, high bun. I'm gonna scrunch it up a little bit to get a little higher. Make sure it's not flat. And my face. Yeah, and this is the outfit. Also gonna pair um, my sunglasses, my oversized ones. I think they're in the car. But I'm gonna pair my oversized sunglasses with this too. So, yes, honey, she is cute today. Also, let me add. I want to add just like a little bit of highlight to my face, so I have like that natural glow. Let me tell you, this foundation routine. If you want to see that? Let me know, cause it is like y'all. I can't. And then I turn it around. But y'all. Foundation routine is undefeated. Undefeated. I know I need to get my eyebrows done. Don't tell me. I'm letting them grow out right now. But yeah, this is like my outfit right now. 
you like the oversized pants i mean if you want it more fitted you can get it more fitted i just like it oversized a little bit it adds like a little bit more street to it yeah let me know what you think about my outfit all right y'all so we're finally about to go this is the final look decided on this black star coat because we are taking the metro and I don't want to be cold because my shirt is short sleeve. So the fur inside keeps me warm and I have the Air Forces. I have my Supreme crossbody um, that I got last, let me see, like last, around this time maybe, like in April last year um, that I carry with me and yeah. I had to take my case off my um <laughs> sorry say it went on case um but yeah this is the final look feeling really sporty mom-ish but yeah American flag arts and crafts and we're gonna go outside to take a picture because as you see this light is bright 
What? <laughs> I just asked us. <laughs> here to see our former president. We don't care about these other people. We just here for him. <laughs>
Michelle and Barack. What did you think of their portraits? Y'all are kind of dry. They were good. They were really, really good. They were good. They were really, really good. Do you pay us to be on your vlog? They're just taking that. <laughs> you want to, I don't get paid to do it yet, so. When I need to sign consent forms, I'm not showing Kalia and Nixon because they're underage. Don't show me either. Why? You don't want to be seen. Oh my god. Alright. Let me do it. I can't, I'm trying to position it. I was trying to position it. Okay, here we go. I can see you. Okay, but you're definitely not being seen because you're not going to be on there. But anyway. I wish we would have started on the other side. First. Yeah, we definitely should have started. No, well, no, we, we should have started on the fourth the floor. Yeah, we should have passed all that. We should have started on the pieces. Yeah. Where there were no black people. So the first floor was no black like. Portraits. What was the first floor? It was. It was like Civil War. Yeah. And period pieces where there were very few black portraits. And then the second one, that was like kind of the same. Obama was on the second floor. And no, but before Obama. Before no, Obama, it yeah, was. Obama was on the second floor. Yeah, but before Obama, it was like the same thing. It was like, but it got to more of a like. Um, like well, what? in the back, they they started showing more black, you know, like minorities. Yeah. When well, they started, yeah, they started. Uh, they started showing the Native Americans. Yeah, we should have started. And then they those. went to the presidents. Because by the time it was really, but it wasn't good. even all black people. It was just like Native Americans, and that was it. I thought there was some people. Yeah, there were a few. It was a few, but it was like that was after Obama, though. After we left Obama, we went to the third floor. No, um, um. The, the writer, he was on behind Obama, the one with the, um, what's his name? Yeah. I can't think of his name. There were a couple pieces. And then when you got to the third floor, there were more African Americans and stuff like that. We yeah. should have started. And we didn't get to yeah, the fourth floor, fourth floor at all. And they had. Oh, uh, what was on the fourth floor? It was pictures of like Muhammad Ali. Um, it was all the champions. But oh. they were like, they were African Americans. Pictures and portraits of things yeah. that were in the book. By that time, we should have packed. We were hungry. We should have not done the first floor at all. Yeah, I agree. No first floor. No. And then the second floor was good with the presidents and stuff. It was some nice things on the second floor, too. Don't get me wrong. Don't do the first floor. Um, yeah. And then the third floor with Michelle. And the only then thing on the first floor that was African American was always oh, a picture of Frederick Douglass. And it was that bus of Booker T. Washington. That was it. Oh, no, no. Do the first floor because Kobe's on the first floor. Oh, Kobe. Oh, yeah. yeah, Kobe's, yeah. Kobe's, Kobe's on, on the first, first floor. floor. Jeff Bezos. Um, your, who else? Your oh, Anna Wintour. <laughs> I want to get Anna Wintour. Yeah, like, I would go to where, the, yeah, the fourth floor where the snack bar cafe is. Start on that side. Start on that side yeah, and then go upstairs. The yeah. elevator is right there and go right upstairs. But, yeah. Uh, Kalia, what did you like? The we the atrium. We was, for you. was it the atrium? nice oh yeah the atrium is nice i would go there like on a work day and chill you can bring your own food because they don't check your bags like i thought they did it says security check but there was no security check so you could have really brought food in there but yeah this is our day blog are you stopping to get something to eat or no when you yeah home? is that gonna be on your blog too what you stopping to get some to eat? Yeah. No, I didn't put the food line either. But you know, we're going to get some to eat, then I'm taking a nap. Make sure, mom, say make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Say what? Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. To my channel. Bye. Everybody say bye. And tell her she needs to pay her mother to be on her blog. Okay, let me just end this because she tripping. Bye.